President Muhammadu Buhari has fired the security details and other persons in Aso Villa over the role they played in the crisis between his wife, Aisha, and Sabi Utunde Yusuf, his assistant. Those fired by Buhari on Wednesday included his chief personal security officer, chief DT to president, ADC to the first lady, escort commander, ADC national defense council, and 37 others from the villa. Sarah reporters had on Tuesday exclusively reported that President Buhari, who was deeply angered by the embarrassing crisis in Asu Villa, was preparing to fire his security duties and some top aides for the roles they all played in dragging the presidency into the mud. It was gathered that the president, President Buhari, decided to take the step after Mama Daura, his nephew, and one of his closest confidants, was seen weeping as he made his way to his office. Dara was said to have informed Buhari that his security aides were not only after Yusuf's life but his own as well. Hmm. Buhari gave the nod for all persons involved in the alleged threat to the lives of the two men to be removed. The crisis started with Yusuf's refusal to embark on a 14-day isolation period after returning to Abuja from a trip to Lagos last week. This led to the arrest and eventual redeployment of the ADC to Mrs. Buari and other security details attached to her after it was claimed that they threatened to kill the president's assistance in the process of trying to get him out of the villa. Inside sources said the latest step by the president could further stir the bad blood among different power, be, uh, power blocks in Asu Villa, especially with the first lady vowing to take a pound of flesh for being embarrassed by Yusuf and other Kaba members. <laughs> Buhari is, a, is angered. Which angered? He can be angered after medicine after death. If you don't do the right thing, of course, a lot of embarrassment like this will be, will be coming up. If you don't put your ass in order, if you don't know what you are doing at as, as this age and time, great grandpa even young boys that are even getting married they know how to keep their homes not to talk of a somebody who has a who has <coughs> honestly is, is unfortunate he's angered at this age and time not that even like i said younger youth young young boys getting married they take they you know they keep their home intact they do everything everything is intact now he's, he's angered this thing happened before now it's been happening over and over again the woman is always coming out but he's never angered when He's never angered or never angry when the woman will come to the social media and be saying, oh, they have uh, hijacked uh, the position or the, the government from your hand. You are not uh, embarrassed by that one. Is that not a, a huge embarrassment that you are not competent? You are not. They just know what they are doing there. They will just say, oh, Buhari said this. Buhari said that. So, like the way some people will say, you might not even know what is happening there. Not somebody that cannot speak heart to heart to the people unless a uh, speech will be written to him. And he will not be saying it. We don't, you don't even understand. The majority of people don't even understand what he says when he comes out occasionally to even read all those speeches. He says he's angered. How, why, if really that there is this coordination in your family, the woman wouldn't have gone to do what he has, uh, she went to do or to go and force somebody to do the needful. They are talking about it according to what uh, the woman said. That, you know, for, for the man to be protected and you didn't have a discussion with your wife, Aisha was telling us the other time that, oh, the man has always been busy. That's why she does not have a pillow talk with him. Now, you, there's no, nobody's going anywhere. Nobody's traveling anywhere. You are all, this, you are all in that uh, Asu Villa. Yet, she cannot have a one-on-one -on -one relationship with you. You people cannot coordinate yourselves. You can see the way they are just embarrassing themselves, whether the wife and all of them, especially the president. It's unfortunate. You can, that is why you can see the way the country is going. By the time they must have done all manner of things, that is when they will not be coming out and be, you know, it's just like a, a, a campaign after election. Now his anger, they doing this and this and that. And Mama Daura crying that his life is in danger because of Mama Daura came to cry to him. That he was weeping. Uh, his life is also is in danger. Who are you in the first place that you're even mentioning Mama Daura here? What are they doing in Asu Villa? That is the question people are asking. It's unfortunate. Whether next time Nigerians will be able to, they will not be deceived by somebody say, oh, I have this, I have this, I have done this. Uh, uh, integrity, what kind of integrity is that? Somebody who has integrity will not allow this whole thing to have slipped into the public. Because the woman does not have who to report to. If, if, the, woman wants, uh, if the woman wanted her uh, 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 aids to be released, it's not in, in her place to go on social media. The woman would have done the needful. 
unless they are telling us they are not together. It's unfortunate that he's angered to uh, uh, to take that decision to sack this. And whether he likes it, if you sack them, you cannot sack them. After all, whatever they are doing, they, they are not even adding to the uh, adding uh, uh, good uh, whatever to the people. They are not even adding positive things to the lives of the people. They are just they let them do and let them leave the old place because it's just like a uh, just occupying a place and you are not doing anything. See the process going on in the north. Now they are arresting people up and down. You will not be hungered. When people are killed, you will not be hungered. Unfortunate. Until Sabu goes, the matter is still not settled. He has brought this respite to his office. We must learn to separate sentiment from official circles and matter of decorum if we are to move forward as a nation. Someone that should be sacked is sacking someone. <laughs> someone is laughing here. I will always say it. If they like, they should come and arrest me. President Buhari is not in the Asso Rock. This is a bloody lie. How can Daura and a very close confidence of the president be weeping and telling lies that uh, Yusuf, <laughs> I say Yusuf, Yusuf and his life uh, uh, are in danger? Who is Yusuf, by the way? A far cousin to the president compared to Aisha Buhari and the children to the president himself. Must Daura stay in Asu Rock? Does he uh, not have his own house? Really, it's Daura controlling the country, not Buhari. Yusuf is closer to PMB, but you are useless comments. Rubbish is your dad is Asu Rock. Okay, answer me. Okay, see this one. <laughs> okay, now this one is Yusuf too. Okay, I am not a fan of a pres of a President Buhari, but the First Lady should just go and sit down and stop seeking for power as if she's an elected officer. She is the cause of the of this Buhaha. Someone said, I think the First Lady just wants to survive in the villa. She has been sidelined for the past five years now. She needs to protect her husband and her children also. Mm. Someone said, you just spoke the truth because the woman should go and sit down. Really? John, what about this uh, Daura man? There's no crisis in Asso Rock without his name being mentioned. <laughs> she she won't be sorry, men Jani. Have you said this on the talk? What do you have to say about his uncles and nephews around him? Leave the first lady alone. She's more recognized than any of them by protocol. That is just the position. Yeah. She's uh cause she's the cause. I don't want is a problem. I don't know what is a problem. She's not the cause. Like somebody is asking, who should be more closer to the president than uh, more than his wife? Is the wife now? So this uh, Daura, like I said, what is he doing in the villa? Is unfortunate. What is he doing in the fil in the villa? <laughs> Let me not say villa. What is he doing in the in the villa? I swear. Okay, um, Oga president. Don't you think the people who started the crisis should be sacked? Acrimony and attrition is already deeply sown and rooted. And rooted my opinion only. Don't worry, the insecurity is he deliberately refused to fight, he's slowly crawling in his hiding place in Nasuro, one way or the other. Aisha Buari has truly been relegated to the kitchen and the other room with the firing of our ADC and other social security details. Another says because the security is about to be told, I think it's Aisha that is ruling the country. Government Turn to family ownership. It is not yet over. Mama Daura and Sabu should also be sacked. What is wrong with Sabu isolating himself after returning from Lagos? I am of the view that the spirit equity, which I know Abuari believe and practice, and everyone involved should have been fired, irrespective of relationship with which supposed to include the. Okay, is it the first lady? Someone said, because the truth is about to be told, I think Aisha is ruling the country, okay? Thumbs up, Mr. President, though I truly wish this issue we, was never made public. The person who refused to be isolated after a trip to Lagos should be made to say what his mission was, to infect the villa. He should be the one to trail others doing that if he really loves Mr. President. They are just deceiving themselves. Honestly, they are just deceiving themselves. Let them not sack themselves. But the 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 interesting one there is that a Daura mama Daura crying, weeping that his life is is in danger. <laughs> oh my goodness! So guys, let's hear your opinion. Leave your comment below in the comment section, and let us have your take as usual. Thank you.